Nitrogen exists in different forms in the air, soil, water and in living organisms. The soil is a major reservoir for nitrogen in an agricultural system. The nitrogen cycle is complex and involves many different soil microorganisms and enzymes. Nitrogen from the air can be converted into ammonium by bacteria that live in the nodules on the roots of legumes or by other bacteria that live freely in the soil. This process is known as nitrogen fixation. Nitrogen fertilisers are usually applied as urea or ammonium compounds such as ammonium phosphate. Urea is converted to ammonia by urease enzymes in the soil and can then be converted to ammonium by bacteria and other microorganisms such as archaea and fungi. Large amounts of ammonium in the soil can form an aqueous ammonia that escapes to the air as ammonia gas. This process is called volatilisation. The soil organic matter pool contains decaying plant material and manure, which are food for the living organisms in the soil. Soil organisms such as bacteria and fungi turn nitrogen in the organic matter into ammonia and then into ammonium and release it back into the soil. Some of the soil microorganisms also take up the ammonium and immobilise it, releasing it back into the soil when the microorganisms die. Ammonium may be converted into nitrite and then to nitrate by nitrifying soil bacteria and archaea. This process is known as nitrification. Nitrous oxide may be generated by nitrifying soil bacteria. Both ammonium and nitrate in the soil can be taken up by plant roots. Ammonium can also be trapped by some clay minerals. This is called ammonium fixation. Fixed ammonium can only be slowly released for plants and microorganisms to use. Nitrate not taken up by plant roots can also be immobilised by soil microorganisms. When these soil microorganisms die and become part of the soil organic matter pool, the cycle of organic nitrogen to ammonia and then ammonium continues. Nitrate will be leached below the root zone if not captured by plants and soil microorganisms. Nitrate leaching contributes to soil acidification. Denitrification typically occurs when there is little to no oxygen, as in a waterlogged soil. A diverse range of denitrifying microorganisms progressively convert nitrate to nitrite to nitric oxide, nitrous oxide and nitrogen gas. These gases can then escape into the atmosphere as the soil dries. Nitrogen can also be removed from the agricultural system by harvest of plants and animal products, by soil erosion and in surface water runoff. The nitrogen cycle is complex and different parts of the cycle can be happening simultaneously. Transformations of nitrogen throughout the cycle can be continuous or sporadic depending on soil and climatic conditions.